Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back to another Lineage Red Knights. Um, so, yeah, new new day, new. Uh, they actually they they gave us the the Phoenix yesterday as well. That's actually pretty cool. Um, they're starting to give out a lot of these monsters for free. Like the Phoenix is actually really really strong. They they I think for the event they gave everyone this Phoenix for free. So um, if you logged in yesterday, you should have gotten him. Uh, yeah, he's he's very similar to the 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 bone dragon or, or the skeletal dragon. I think it's called bone dragon. Yeah, the bone dragon. Um, he has a chance to revive every time that he dies, and he's he's magic type, so he's like kind of different. He does magical damage. Um, he does like basically a magical damage over. Well, actually, his his damage over time is physical, which is pretty pretty interesting. Um, but he he's basically just a nuker with fear, and he also. Um, the the cool thing about him is he also gains like um, you know damage reduction the moment that he he resurrects and it, it lasts it lasts ten seconds which is actually pretty long so I think he's definitely going to be a pretty good monster for for doing um, for doing arena battles and stuff because like if he if he dies then the monsters start focusing some other monster and then he, he, he like comes back and then he's like super tanky. Um, but it's very situational. I think maybe like if I keep him as the last uh, last person on my list or something like that, it might actually be better. Anyways, uh, we're gonna we're gonna do some do some battles, do some some random things, and also uh, do do my daily summons. So I've kind of been saving up my 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 diamonds. I haven't really been spending them. I basically I think I'm going to. I'm going to start donating, like using them to donate to to the um, to the guild for like more sweep tickets and stuff. I I I'm not playing the game super seriously, but I, I I'm still trying to farm as much as possible. So um, I always buy the sweep tickets from the shop. I also you know always donate with my with my gold every single day to to get more sweep tickets. Um, so I think it it might be a pretty good investment for me because you get half the like basically you get. Um, 50 daggers every time that you donate 100, um, 100 gems, and then your guild also becomes stronger, and you you get a lot of sweep tickets basically. Um, actually, you have a higher chance than to get 50 daggers. You actually have a pretty. Wait, why do I have Zeline equip? Actually, really interesting. I don't remember putting on Zeline. Why would I have Zeline equip? That is very weird. I think I wanted to enchant him, but I accidentally equipped him instead. Alright, I also remember that we're gonna we're gonna have to go and start farming that vampire. Um Might as well Might as well get started on that. Should be able to reach the top floor today if I if I do things properly. All right, this Baphomet are in. Um, I'm gonna go with my just my main comp. Take out these two. Put in put in my succubus. Put in put in an Oga. Hmm. I'm not sure if this is the right one. Maybe I should use a Dell. But how did I fail this last time? I feel like I need some damage. Like I need some, I need some serious damage. Um, I'm gonna go with Dragon, Arin, and Adele. All right, or Drake. I mean, it's literally just Baphomet and Arin, but she's buffing him like crazy. She's also healing like crazy. Come on, come on, die. Yes! Perfect. Alright, alright, excellent. I think the last time I wasn't able to beat him because I used two healers and I wasn't able to actually kill him.
These guys are probably pretty weak. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my Death Knight and see if I can uh, if I can cleave through this. So the interesting thing is in the tower now. If if you actually get the boss to spawn, um, the boss has a hundred percent chance to at least drop one piece. So if you're lucky, you can you can pretty much get three pieces of a boss each day. Like if you get get the boss to spawn three times a day, um, then you can get three pieces each day, which is pretty good. Which means it won't take that long to actually farm the boss. Alright, that was relatively easy. Um, it might be a little bit harder, but I, sh I should be able to... Should be able to beat this with this comp. I, I've like forgotten how strong the Death Knight actually was in PvE. He's pretty insane. Oh shit, I feel like my backline's gonna die. If I, don't, if I don't cleave harder, I'm, I'm pretty much fucked. Alright, nice, that was perfect. And she came out. But that has got to be the, the sluttiest costume ever, you know. I swear to god. Um, dang, Arin Death Knight Spartoy. All right. Since you wanna, you wanna go. Since you wanna play like that, I'm, I'm gonna just, um, I'm gonna go like this. Double physical comp. Or triple physical if you include Vara. Wreck this Spartoy hard. And it's hard for his Death Knight to kill Kurtz. I think. Should be a little bit hard. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! That Death Knight's gonna kill my Death Knight. I'm pretty sure he is. Oh shit, he got the crit buff. And he killed my Kurtz. Dang, that was rough. That was really rough. Thing about the Death Knight is he he's the highest um he's basically the like the highest uh or the tankiest physical like damage dealer that isn't a tank if you just look at his stats all right I'm on 69 I have three tickets left I lost my Kurtz and I lost my death knight which is actually all right to be honest um actually no that's not all right <laughs> Hmm, if I put in this comp, would I lose my Adele really fast? I feel like I might lose my Adele really fast. I mean, I need to I need to get a heal up, like, fast. Alright, maybe I can just last long enough for my Arin and Olga to heal up my Adele. Oh shit, she's gone. And I'm running double heal, this is not good. <laughs> this is really, really bad. Please, no, Orin, don't die. I need I need you. I need you to fight the boss stage. Can't lose Orin. No, don't die. Orin, live. Yes! Holy shit. Alright, um... Dang, this is getting rough. Well, he's got two magical tanks. I mean, I don't have any other tanks besides Baphomet. Maybe I should level him up a bit. Let's just let's just uh level up his skills a bit. Especially his evasion. His evasion probably you should focus on that. Okay, this is, this shit's getting ex expensive.
Alright, it should be pretty good. It's like almost 30%. Oh wait, no, it's not story, it's tower. Well, if I if I fail this, I'll still have another try. Uh, I can still go in again, and then they'll be at, at a certain amount of HP, so... I think it would be ideal for me to just bring... Yeah, probably just bring this comp. Oh dang, that animation was pretty sweet. Nice, alright, I did my nuke. Buff up. Come on, Baphomet. Evade harder. Dude, her attack animation is really sweet. Oh shit, I even lost Lara. Alright, I still got this. Now yeah, we got this. We got we got a lot of armor break. Um Guess I'll use Vashu then. Oh what? They respawn? Oh shit! Dude, I can't beat this. She's actually really strong. Like, how am I supposed to beat this without without my Lara? Dude, she hits so fucking hard. It's insane. All right, rip. Yeah, I can't beat her. Maybe if I if I still had a doll I could beat her, but holy shit, that was that was rough. Um, all right, let's just do my summon. We'll 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 call it a day. All right, we'll call it a day. Damn it, it's another box. Fuck this box. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.